This hose reel is eight years old and on its last leg. Barely winds up anymore. It's not even on the reel again. This gizmo doesn't slide back and forth very well. And on top of that, it leaks like crazy. Ugh. Messes like this are not uncommon in here. Recently, I had to wind up my hose like this because it was leaking so much. All right, pal, time is up. And check out what has arrived. Hey guys and gals, welcome to Garage Gear, I'm JB. In this video, we're reviewing the Giraffe one half inch by 130 foot wall mounted retractable garden hose reel. Is it a worthy investment? Let's find out, stick around. I use my garden hose for so many tasks around my garage and my yard. Washing the vehicles, watering the lawn. Let's face it, if it needs water, the hose is being used. I calculated that I extend my garden hose out on average four to six times per week. That's 200 to 300 windups per year. That's a lot of windups. And I have been wanting to get my hands on a retractable unit for a long time. It's that time of the show where we unbox that. Item! We have our instruction manual, our heavy duty mounting bolts, our nine function nozzle, our connecting hose, and our unit itself. Let's get this one unhooked and out of the way. Still leaving its mark before it goes. Unbelievable. So what we gotta do here is take a screwdriver with a Phillips head and remove this screw here at the bottom. This will allow us to get our bracket off so we can mount it to the wall. Screw comes out, set that aside. Slide the unit around and off comes our mount. Let's get this mounted up. So I know where I'm gonna mount this thing. I have my water spigot right here. My mount will go right next to that here on the wall. I'm gonna put it right where I want it. Make sure it's nice and level so that way it doesn't look weird when it's sitting there on the wall. That looks nice and level right there. I have a stud that runs behind this panel right here and then I'll use the mounting hardware that they provided from Giraffe Tools to mount into this board on this side. So I'm gonna take my pencil, draw in my dots. And there we go. Here is the mounting hardware. These two will be going directly into the wall, into the stud. These two will be going into these wall sinkers on the other side. I'm gonna drill my first two here on this side. Definitely found the stud. Now for this side, I have to use a slightly bigger bit because I have to use a wall mount. And here's something interesting I just learned. Behind this panel, right behind this hole, is another board. So this screw is going directly in. I don't need one of these mounts here. I just need one up top. Not bad. We're gonna take this guy, tap it in with a hammer. Now what we're gonna do is take a 13 millimeter socket on an impact driver, and we're gonna send these bolts through our mount into the wall. Other one here on this side. With two bolts, that thing is on there already. That's crazy. This side. And then up top. Next, we're gonna put on our connecting hose. And if you notice here, these connections are really well made and connected well to the hose. These will not leak. These are very well built. Well done, giraffe. Don't forget to put your rubber gasket inside. There we go. Now, if you are mounting this bracket to a brick wall, just make sure you use all the hardware that they provide and it'll stay on nice and strong. Okay, now that mount is on, let's get the hose reel on it. Now, this hose unit is a little heavy with all that hose wound up inside, but with this handle on the back, it makes it a lot easier to carry. We're just gonna slide it right in. We're gonna reinstall that screw from earlier. Now we're gonna connect the hose on the side. Make sure you get your gasket inside, whisk it right on. Look at that! That's what convenience looks like. Pivots 180 degrees. I'm a little limited here by this cabinet, but that's okay for my application. Let's extend this all the way out or just about to it. I'm 
I'm across the street. I can water the neighbor's lawn. Check out how far out I am. See that stop tape on the hose? That's there so you know when to stop pulling the hose out and you can retract it safely. Now it is a good idea to shut your water off and drain any water out of the hose before you retract it. Getting all the water out and then retracting it will extend the life of the unit. Nice thing about this hose is it locks into any position and with a simple tug it starts going right back. In we go. got a nice guide system that slides back and forth as it retracts so you never get any tangles inside this reel. This is just awesome. This is a medium to high grade hose, meaning that it won't kink or wear down easily. This 130 foot half inch diameter hose passed the 200 PSI pressure test and the 600 PSI bursting pressure test and is great for indoor and outdoor use. So by now you may be asking JB, is this hose reel worth it? Let's look at it like this. It would take me about one minute to wind up that old hose. Six times per week, that's six minutes. Six minutes times 52, that's 312 minutes per year spent winding up a hose? That's five hours a year just cranking away on this thing. That's ridiculous, not anymore, baby. A decent 100 foot hose is probably gonna run you somewhere in the neighborhood of $65. A large reel such as this is probably gonna run you somewhere in the area of $90. Then you tack on a nozzle for another $10. Adding that all together, you're into this whole setup for about $165. For $30 more, you get a lot more peace of mind, no more horrible hose fights, and hours of your life back. Big shout out to Giraffe Tools for sending me this hose reel. Thank you, you guys rock. They even sent me this very cool 50 foot retractable cord reel. Mounts to the wall pretty much the same way as the hose reel did. Pivots 180 degrees, has a three cord adapter on the bottom, and I can pull this guy way out. Locks in place, and then with a simple tug, boom, it retracts right back in. This is perfect for detailing cars in the driveway. I can scale back on my power cords now. Big thanks again to Giraffe Tools. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's a good hard look at the 130 foot retractable hose reel from Giraffe Tools. For more awesome Giraffe Tools and products, check out the links down below in the description. And don't just stop at one, check out more cool Garage Gear videos linked down below. Follow me further at Garage Gear JB on Instagram. And if you enjoyed this video, give me one of these. And remember, if you're feeling the vibe and you wanna be part of the tribe, subscribe so that way you can stay up to date with everything going on here at Garage Gear. Thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you in the garage.